Yeah. All right, guys. So tonight, Milo and I are going to talk about the uh, most popular moves in arm wrestling. So first of all, we should understand that basically all good arm wrestling is done in the strap. So have a neutral slip where it's completely, completely uh, the same for both. You have a pronated underhand slip where Miles on top, Miles on top, and I just kick my roll, and I get to slip that way, uh, or I can I can do a flop at the bottom. But most of the time in arm wrestling, you're gonna end up in a strap. So, in good arm wrestling. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So you can arm wrestle without a strap, but in my humble opinion, somebody's doing it wrong. If you're if you're gonna lose you didn't you didn't uh, try everything that you could so in a strap the three most basic moves are top roll hook and press first mile will demonstrate the top roll okay so what it is it's an attack through your opponent's fingertips okay he pressures up into my fingers and he cups and he rolls making my wrist bend back and he carries on to the pad through the weak spot that he exposes into my fingers. This is the top roll. Post up, cup and roll, and move your body to the side. All right, the next uh, most uh, common move in arm wrestling is probably the hook, okay? I'll do the hook. So the first thing you're trying to do when you do the hook technique is get your wrist bent. Okay, so on the ready go, you are going to get your wrist bent. There are several different types of hook, but all of them work by getting your wrist bent. Um, some of them, you will keep your pronation, like a nice high hook, but most hooks will sacrifice the pronation of your palm to achieve getting your wrist bent. A lot of them will look something like this. Don't move, ready go. The shoulder will move forward. You will attain some kind of a wrist bend. And at that point, you can drag your opponent to the pad heavily through your wrist flexion. It will look something like this. A hook. A hook. All right. Get your wrist bent. Once you have the bend, go to the side. And this is a standard hook. Next most common technique is a press. It's similar to the hook, but more the shoulder is moving forward the entire way, okay? So Milo will demonstrate this one. Okay, on the go, he will continue to push and get behind his, his hand and press me to the pad. He will isolate my arm. His body will be behind his arm mechanically making it very difficult for me to get into the match with my frame and he will overpower me. The press is probably one of the structurally most powerful moves in arm wrestling. These are the three most common moves, hook, top roll and press. Now we'll get into two of the more fringe moves, however, very popular. Um, the next move we will cover is the king's move. The King's Move is a form of top roll. It is a defensive form of top roll where you will give away things like internal rotation. You will actually go to the outside. You will give away your wrist, potentially your cupping, and you will hold on to your pronation. You will drag your opponent and you will pronate hard to attack their wrist. And it looks something like this. Don't move, ready, go. As Milo tries to top roll me, he will run into the wall through my pronation and make it very difficult for him to finish the match. Right, the can't do it. Can't do it. The king's move focuses on steering the pressure into the opponent's fingers through pronation. It is not an internal attack. It is a swinging out into the, your opponent's fingertips. The last most common move is the flop wrist press. Okay, the flop wrist press is a press that gives up the cupping aspect of the press 
to further secure shoulder angle. Do you want to do this one? Or you want me to do it? Sure. Yeah. Okay. So as we start to break into the move, Milo will go forward and he will give up his wrist to further get his shoulder behind the match. Here he is, deeply behind, deeply behind. The flopper is pressed quite often in the visualization of, of the match. You will see your opponent's arm and you will know that if both people move their shoulders forward, you will win this. At all costs, in the flopper is pressed, the shoulder continues to move forward at all costs. Right. Ready, go this time. It's me. Okay, yeah, yeah. Let's do it a little bit. Ready, go. There we He's go. got it. <laughs> so there's the most common moves in arm wrestling: hook, top row press, king's move, flopper's press. Stay masked, everybody.